Hello children, how are you all? I hope you all are fit and fine. So are you studying at your home? I hope you are because studying is very important. Okay, so welcome back to another video. In this video, we will be learning about rearrange letters. So what is rearrange letters and how to do that? For that we need to dive into this video. Look here. What you can see in this picture? Here it's written A T H. Okay? So does it mean anything A T H? No. So what we need to do? We need to arrange this to form a word. So what we can form? So A T H. So if we rearrange it will become H A T hat. So hat means this. This is a hat. So this is how we need to rearrange all the letters. Okay? Look at this. What you can say? K O C L C. Does it make any word? No, it doesn't make any meaning. So we need to rearrange all the letters so that we can form a word. Look, this is clock. So by rearranging the letters, we can form the word clock. C-L-O-C-K. Clock. Next we have K-M-L-I. So what does it mean? It means nothing, right? So we will arrange it to make a meaning. Yes, this is milk. M-I-L-K. So this is how we need to arrange the letters to make a meaning of from a word. Okay? So, what is next? Next is R-D-A-B-E. What is R-D-A-B-E? It doesn't make any sense, right? It doesn't have any meaning. So, we will rearrange. So, what is that? Bread. B-R-E-A-D. This is a bread. So, by rearranging the words, we got bread. And the next is G-E-G. -E so, what does G-E-G -E means? Let's rearrange. Yes, it's egg now. E-G-G, -G, egg. So, now we will see another example. So, here the words are P-L-A-P-E. -E. What does P-L-A-P-E -E means? It means nothing. So, arrange it. Now, it becomes apple. A P P L E apple. Next we have E C K A. Does it make any sense? Does it make any word? No. So we will arrange all the letters. Now it becomes cake. Right? This is a cake. C A K E cake. The next one is the next one is I F H S. So can you tell me children what does it will mean if you rearrange the letter? It will become fish. F I S H fish. Next we have G J U. So what does it stand for if you rearrange? It's a jug. J U G jug. Next we have T B A O. What is T B A O means? It doesn't make any sense, right? So we will rearrange it. It becomes boat. B O A T. So, kids, this is how we need to practice rearranging the words. It's very interesting, right? So, do practice at your home. Okay, children? So, we will see you in our next video. Bye bye.